I want to share with you a little bit about the Holy Shroud of Turin. The Shroud of Turin is believed to be the burial cloth in which the, the, the body of Jesus uh, was wrapped after his crucifixion when Jesus was placed in the tomb. And the, the shroud has an, uh, the image of the body of Christ, the front and the back, uh, imprinted on it. And the Shroud of Turin, it's the most studied uh, sacred image or image at all in the whole world. They say that over 600,000 hours of scientific studies have been done on the Shroud of Turin, and it still remains a mystery. Uh, the Shroud of Turin really is the greatest uh, sacred image uh, in Christianity. I just want to share with you seven amazing things about the Shroud of Turin. First of all, when you look at the Shroud of Turin as it is, the face of Christ is kind of a shadowy image. But when you take a photograph of the face of Christ, uh, the, the photographic negative uh, reveals to us a much more clear and, and detailed uh, image of the face of Christ, which is totally amazing. A second uh, amazing thing about the, the Shroud of Turin is that nobody can figure out how it was made. It's not a painting against uh, scientists have studied this uh, so carefully. Their best guess is that the image was imprinted by an instant blast of light or radiation that scor scorched the, the image um, or the, the, the linen giving us the image of the, the body of Christ. Third uh, uh, amazing thing about the Shroud of Turin is that it has within it 3D information encoded. When uh, the shroud was photographed with special 3D imaging technology, uh, the, the, the imaging that they got actually uh, gave a 3D image of the body of Christ, and no other paintings do that. Another amazing thing about the Shroud of Turin is it reveals perfect anatomy in terms of the blood flows uh, from the different wounds, how the blood would flow based on whether it was veins or arteries and what kind of arteries. Uh, amazing stuff. This, it's been studied by many uh, doctors. The other amazing thing is that when they studied the Shroud of Turin, they found that there is real human blood on it. And also, the Shroud of Turin reveals so many of the wounds of Christ, the crown of thorns, the wounded side, the pierced hands and feet, and especially all the scourge marks with, which cover so much of Jesus' body. And then finally, scientists have found uh, in, in, in the dust uh, on the Shroud of Turin uh, pollen from uh, plants that can only be found in the area of Jerusalem. And also on the back, where, the back of the head of Jesus, uh, particles of wood, which we believe would be from the cross, uh, that Jesus died on, and also particles of dust at, at Jesus' heels, because Jesus would have walked bare feet through the streets of Jerusalem. Uh, the face of Christ in the Shroud of Turin is, is very powerful. I encourage you to get an image of the Shroud of Turin and meditate especially on His holy face uh, and allow the Lord uh, to speak to your heart uh, as He reveals His, His face to you.